The sun was supposed to be chilling out, but instead, it's heating up stronger than anyone predicted. It's blasting out storms, shaking satellites, and leaving scientists scratching their heads in disbelief. In this breakdown, we're diving into why this sudden spike in solar chaos has the space community stunned, and what it could mean not just up there, but right here on Earth. It all started when Solar Cycle 25 kicked off in December 2019. Experts back then said it'd be weak, maybe even quieter than the last one. For years, the trend had looked steady, sunspots fading, solar winds calming, and the sun's mood mellowing out. Many even believed we were entering another long nap phase, like the quiet solar periods from past centuries. But man, that prediction didn't age well. By 2023, the sun had already flipped the script. Sunspot numbers soared higher than expected. And by 2024, massive solar storms were lighting up the skies. Entire regions saw glowing auroras stretching far beyond the poles, while communication systems glitched and satellites scrambled for cover. The sun wasn't following any of the models. It was rewriting its own rules. Trying to figure out what went wrong, NASA researchers Jamie Jasinski and Marco Velli pulled solar wind data all the way back to 2008. What they discovered was wild. Almost every measurement had climbed. Speed, density, temperature, pressure, magnetic field strength, all rising. This wasn't some random burst of solar flare drama. It was a full-on power boost across the board. That meant one thing. The long decline scientists thought they understood had completely reversed. And here's the kicker. It wasn't because of bad data. The sun simply changed in ways the models didn't see coming. Even with centuries of tracking sunspots and decades of satellite data, the sun still finds ways to humble science. Its magnetic dance is messy and unpredictable, and the connections between its surface chaos, deep flows, and long-term cycles still confuse even the best experts. What started as a small mismatch between predictions and real-world data has turned into a mystery that's keeping researchers up at night. Why did a supposedly weak sun suddenly roar back to life? What does it mean for the next decade of solar behavior? At the center of all this drama is the solar dynamo, the hidden engine that powers the sun's magnetic fields. The old models said weaker winds and fewer sunspots meant we were heading for a quiet stretch. But ever since 2008, the opposite has been happening. The sun's getting louder, stronger, and more unpredictable, and nobody knows where this wild comeback ends. One theory shaking things up is the Hale Cycle, a 22-year magnetic rhythm that might be running the real show behind the sun's wild mood swings. Every so-called 11-year solar cycle could just be one half of this longer hidden loop. If that's true, then what we saw as a weak phase might have just been the sun catching its breath before roaring back twice as strong. But that's not the only twist. History's full of strange chapters where the sun broke all the rules. Take the Maunder Minimum from 1645 to 1715. The skies went dim, sunspots nearly vanished, and parts of Europe froze through brutally long winters. Then came the Dalton Minimum between 1790 and 1830, another cold, unstable era where the sun went quiet again for decades. Scientists still can't fully explain why those calm periods happened, but they all prove one thing. The sun doesn't care about predictions. It moves to its own unpredictable beat. Now flip that pattern. What if today's spike is the reverse version of those ancient minimums? A magnetic surge instead of a collapse. That possibility has researchers on edge and glued to their instruments, trying to decode what the sun's next move might be. And this isn't just academic talk. Accurate forecasting literally protects technology and life on Earth. From power grids and satellites to deep space missions, underestimating the sun's strength could mean massive damage if a superstorm hits unprepared. Still, this surprise also opens a rare window for discovery. 
spacecraft like NASA's Parker Solar Probe and ESA's Solar Orbiter are already flying closer than ever before, catching every pulse, flare, and twist from angles humanity's never seen. The data they're bringing back could finally rewrite everything we thought we knew about the sun's secret rhythm. The instruments aboard those spacecraft aren't just fancy gadgets. They're like detectives built to expose the sun's hidden moods. Every sensor is tuned to capture the raw details of its magnetic fields, solar winds, and invisible shock waves rushing through space. Watching all this unfold during such an unexpected surge is pure gold for scientists. It gives them a front row seat to how the solar dynamo, the fiery engine powering the sun's magnetism, really works. This reversal has forced experts to admit just how limited their current models are, but it's also gifted them a once-in-a-generation chance to study it all in real time. For solar physics, this moment is a rare mix of chaos and discovery, a test that could rewrite decades of assumptions. But a stronger, more aggressive sun doesn't just stay in space, it hits home fast. The most immediate threat comes from geomagnetic storms, those fierce bursts of charged particles that slam into Earth's magnetic shield. When that happens, GPS systems can lose accuracy, radio networks can drop out, and satellites can suddenly glitch or even fry. The last few years have already proven how far and fast those effects can ripple across the planet. And the danger doesn't stop there. Power grids are sitting targets. We've seen it before. Back in 1989, a massive solar storm plunged Quebec into total darkness within minutes, cutting electricity for millions. That was decades ago, when systems were simpler. Now, with our grids linked through vast electronic networks, one intense storm could cause far more damage. Astronauts, too, face growing risks. Radiation spikes could threaten missions to the Moon, Mars, and beyond. The stronger the sun gets, the more urgent it becomes to understand it before it strikes again. The stakes couldn't be higher right now. Every solar storm that erupts doesn't just light up the sky, it floods space with intense radiation, making missions to the Moon and Mars a lot more dangerous. Planning for long-term travel beyond Earth now demands stronger shields, smarter spacecraft, and non-stop monitoring of space weather. One wrong burst could put astronauts and equipment in serious trouble. But it's not all doom and gloom. This sudden surge in solar activity is giving scientists a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to witness the sun in full power mode. They're capturing data on massive flares, coronal storms, and magnetic waves under extreme conditions that no one expected. With spacecraft like Parker Solar Probe and Solar Orbiter feeding in fresh info every week, researchers might soon be able to build smarter models, ones that actually predict these outbursts before they happen. Imagine getting accurate space weather alerts like you do for thunderstorms. That's the future they're chasing. And while these solar tantrums bring real risk, they also paint the sky with breathtaking beauty. Strong storms are pushing auroras far beyond the poles, giving people from cities and small towns around the world a rare chance to see the northern and southern lights glowing over their heads. It's a reminder that the sun's fury comes with moments of pure wonder, too. Still, the big question hangs in the air. Will this fiery streak keep rising or finally calm down? So far, the solar wind's intensity hasn't reached the wild peaks of the early 1900s, so technically, we're not in uncharted territory yet. But that gap between the predictions and what's actually happening is keeping every solar scientist on edge. The message is clear. The sun doesn't follow our timelines, and it's ready to surprise us again whenever it wants. The sun was supposed to be resting, but it's waking up more powerful more unpredictable, and more fascinating than ever before. Its next move could change everything we know about our place in space. So stay tuned, hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one as we keep chasing the mysteries of our incredible star.